everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog and I know I've been MIA for the longest time only because alam mo yun, and daming life ganabs and medyo busy and you know nagpasko nagbagong taon so I just thought of let the holidays pass muna and all of that stuff so anyway guys I miss you so much and I hope na makapag vlog ako more makapag upload ako more but for today, I'm here in Hong Kong and I'll be staying for four days. Yeah, four days, three nights. And today is my first day. It's a Sunday. It's the 20th. And I'm already here in the hotel room. Hindi ko na vlog nung nasa airport ako and all only because I will be uploading a separate vlog for that. For some reason, medyo I'm gearing towards some flight reviews for my uh, contents. But I just find it really fun. Alam mo yon. Pero magastos, the plane ticket and all of that stuff. But anyway, I'm here na nga sa hotel. I'm staying here at Holiday Inn Express in Mong Kok. Mag quick room tour lang tayo. So ayan na yung kabuuan ng room. Pagpasok mo here on the right, kung left or whatever. There's the toilet, the bathroom, and ayan. Simple lang siya, payak at ano. Very straightforward lang. Ni wala ng ano, toiletries, mga besh. Like, walang shampoo, walang anything. Here's the shower. Very, very straightforward lang. And I love this, honestly. At nakakaloka kasi walang bide yung toilet. Like, oh my gosh, punas punas lang. <laughs> and the usual, and ito yung mga uh, cabinet or wardrobe. Ayan, hangers, and all. And dito naman is yung safety deposit box, laundry bag, and uh, slippers. So, okay na. And this is the full length mirror. And if you're a follower sa aking IG account, um, nagpost ako ng IG story doon about my OOTD and things like that. So, ayon. And here's the bed. Ayan. I requested for a queen size bed. There's a workstation and ito yung sofa overlooking itong Danda Street. No, hindi to Danda Street eh. Parang Ferry Street to something. Oh my gosh, ang tataas ng building dito. Nakakaloka. Super, super duper basic lang nitong hotel na to. As in, no frills kind of hotel talaga siya. But, you know, this will do para sa three nights na stay. I think this will do for me. Ayan, may very basic na coffee and tea facilities. And wala nang laman yung ref o. Oh. Natutuwa ako sa itsura ng face ko ngayon. BB cream lang yan. And kilay. And konting liquid blush. But so far, parang ang ganda ng effect niya sa camera. Parang ang ganda ng register, I mean. Parang ang kinis-kinis ko. Ang lambot. Ang fresh. Ganarn. But anyway, I'm supposed to go to Ngong Pin. Ngong Pin nga ba tawag doon? Yung cable car? yung pin. Hindi ko alam kung ano talaga siya. Basta yon yung cable car na crystal cabin churro route. Nung pagbaba ko ng plane, for some reason, biglang sumakit yung ulo ko. Hindi ko maintindihan kung bakit. And honestly, until now, medyo kumikirot-kirot pa siya. <laughs> Kumikirot-kirot pa siya. Hindi ko alam kung bakit. Hindi naman ako nalipasan ng gutom or whatever. I decided na lumabas to explore the vicinity and naglakad lang ako sa kahabaan ng Nathan Road and hinanap ko talaga yung Langham Place and I decided to eat something but it's very wrong mga BFF because it's a Sunday here very wrong lang kasi it's a Sunday today ang daming tao as in baragan kung baragan alam mo yun so I decided na bumalik na lang and then along the way nakita ko yung Jayco and may pa-promo syempre kapit tayo sa promo mga besh uh, parang sandwich and coffee combo and I, I realized na for today wala pa pala talaga akong kape hindi pa ako nagkakape ever so ayun later for dinner labas ulit tayo and um, punta tayo sa night market tignan natin ko anong mga ganap doon so hopefully wala masyadong tao later sa night market but I doubt that but Anyway, we'll see how it will go. And for now, I'll see you guys later. Bye! I miss you guys so much. Totoo, I swear. Hi everyone! Welcome back. At eto nga, nagbabalik. At medyo okay-okay na ako. Medyo nakatulog ako kanina. And uminom na rin ako ng meds. Because medyo masakit talaga siya. I don't think sleeping it out alone would take care of it. 
Okay, so already 7 p.m. mga BFF. Later on, mag-prepare na to go out, have dinner, and go to the night market. Yan ang bed situation right now. So, medyo makalat. Don't judge me. And I'm back! Ayan, so... Um, I decided na dumiretso na ng ladies market. I'm sure naman siguro may makakainan doon. So, doon na lang din humanap ng makakain. And konting shop, shop, ganyan-ganyan. Ang ganda lang ng effect ng BB cream, siguro kasi it works well with the weather. Alam mo yung, yung lamig. Nagtatago ang mga pores, ganyan. Takot ang pores, ganyan. Paisa lang. <laughs> Paisa lang mga friends. Like, oh my gosh, like, I love how luminous the skin is. Alam mo yung, I might be as well in Korea right now. So, ayan, mas Caitlin Road na tayo ng lalakaan. And the night is young. As in, like, talagang so well lit yung streets. And busy-busy ang mga tao. Wal-wal pa rin sila. Kasi nga linggo ngayon. And I'm just walking forwards. Ladies market, and I'll just update you guys when I get there. Here we are, guys. Ladies market. Ayan, chungi chungi ano naman? Ang cute mga onesies. Oh. It's a whole stretch, so um, ano tayo ng mga interesting vibes. Medyo malapit na ako sa dulo nitong night market, pero... So far, wala pa ako nakikita ng nagugustuhan ko. Like, I don't know. Parang same-same lang naman sila. Souvenirs, mga Pekki Galiagang items. Ang hinahanap ko kasi talaga is passport holder. Sira na yung passport holder ko. And so far, wala pa akong makikita. I've reached the end of night market. I mean, ladies market. And unfortunately, medyo wale. Like, I just cannot really find myself to buy anything. Kasi parang same-same lang naman siya. I found a passport holder which is good and it's made of leather but parang my heart is not into it din talaga so I passed na lang so anyway that's pretty much it for the ladies market and let's just go and find something to eat for dinner so ayun dahil nga medyo fail ang ladies market so I decided na bumili na lang ng sarili kong octopus card from the nearest MTR station and while walking, ang nearest na MTR station na nakita ko is tong Yaumate, Yumate basta tong Yaumate na to it's 150 Hong Kong dollars in total and in fairness, may mga kainan din Teka, like, saan ba ako nag-exit? Ala, ayan na. Vlog pa more. Naligaw na naman ako. Finally, meron na akong napiling kainan. And I'm just thankful na I didn't end up with McDonald's. So, kasi parang I'm almost resigned to the fact na for tonight, I'll have McDonald's for dinner. But buti na lang while walking, nakita ko to. It's a Chinese noodle restaurant of some sort. So I asked the ate to recommend me something. This one here, ito yung na-recommend niya. So I'm not sure kung ano yun. Basta sabi niya bestseller daw yun. So why not? And then, I ordered din uh, chicken wings. Napagod ako actually. Pero alam mo yun, parang you wouldn't mind walking kasi malamig naman. So, bonga pala. So ito yung food. Ayan. Noodles, noodles, chururut. Hindi ko alam kung anong lasa niyan. But sabi ko na spicy. So hopefully hindi siya spicy. So tikman natin. And I'm back mga BFF. And medyo napagod ako. Kasi pinagod ako ni Google Maps. As in, pinaikot-ikot niya ako. Ako naman si Tanga. 
sunod. So, but anyway, it was fun. And, um, masarap din naman maglakad outside kasi malamig nga. Anyway, overall, I would have to say na okay naman for first day. It's not bad even though na-miss ko yung Ngong Pin na tour ko, supposedly. I'm not sure if I can refund that. But I'll send an email to Cloak if they would be kind enough to refund it. Kung hindi naman, okay lang. It's my fault din naman. So, so anyway guys, this is where I'll have to end the vlog na because it's almost 11 and maaga tayo bukas because tomorrow we'll be going to Disneyland. Yes, ganyan. So, ayon. Anyway, maraming maraming salamat for being with me today and I hope you enjoyed this video and as always, I will see you on the next one. Bye!